Hello there, this is Dave Allen for Mac Tuna Questions and for Video Magical and today we're going to have a look at motion and see what we can do with 3D. So let's drag a few objects in there and get things moving. So first of all I'm going to drag this molecule of water in there as a start and we'll have this accordion in there as well. So we've got two objects in there. We need to get these things up that they go through the whole of the timeline there. So there's that on the timeline. Okay, so now we've got our two objects in there one in front of the other as it stands at the moment and um, we can't see the uh, molecule of water but we're going to change that so let's get a camera in there click on this button here to add a camera we'll switch to 3d now we can start moving things about so let's get our accordion and we're going to move it back in the frame so it's going to go back through z space so that's moving it back i'm tapping on there and just moving it like that if we have a look at this in the top view so this is our front view. If we want to look at the top view, we can click on there. So there we can see there's our camera. There's our one object and there's our other object. This is the object we're moving, the accordion. So let's go to the molecule of water now. And we'll uh, do the same as we did with that. We'll uh, move it. So moving it forwards. Or we could use this one here to move it. Or we could even move it this way. So we've got all sorts of moves available to us there. So, And it is even possible to uh, rotate these things. Let's go and have a look and see what the active camera is seeing. So this is what the active camera is seeing at present. And what we can do is we can start off by going to the start. And our molecule of water is the front. So we're going to select the molecule of water. And we're going to go to this thing here. And we're going to take it to a frame object. Okay, so that's our starting point, and we'll go to the end. And there we are at the end of the timeline, and we're going to select the accordion. First of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click this here to tell it to record, and then I'm going to tell it to frame the object. So let's frame the object. Okay, so now what I can do is turn that off and go to the start. So here we are at the start, and let's play through that. So it's going from the molecule of water, and it's flying through the scene towards the accordion, which is off in the distance there. Not bad, really. We're getting a bit of uh, 3D action in there. So what else can we do? So let's see if we can make some change to this. So stop that for the moment. Let's put it uh, in the center there. And let's look at it from the camera view. And we're going to tell it to look from the right-hand side. So let's just move this across a little bit so I can see it a little bit better. Okay, so this here is the line of uh, the motion of the camera here, and we can change this. What we can do is we can take this and we can uh, bring it back a bit. So we're starting further away from the molecule of water, and we can bring it down as well. So or we can take it up, so we can start wherever we want to. So that's uh, why we're doing it. And I can click on that there, double click on it, and what we can do is we can make it go over the top of the thing and then come back, come back down again. And we'll just change that there so that it changes the view we're getting as we're going through there. And we're going to also change this as well so that it uh, focuses directly onto this uh, thing here. Okay, so if we bring it towards the end of the... Uh, that's, how the that's how it's going to finish off there. It's going to zoom into our uh, accordion picture. And the way it's going to start here is it's going to be looking at the thing... It's going to go over the top of it and it's going to come down on the other side. So let's just uh, go back to the start and we'll play through that and see how it looks from the camera view. So let's just go to active camera. Okay, so there we are, some distance away from the two objects. And if I press play, it's going to go over the top of the molecule of water, come back down the other side again. Actually, we still see a bit of molecule of water there. And we're zooming in to the accordion. So let's just uh, zoom in on this a bit here so it fits the screen so we can see it a bit better. So how about that? Then that's a handy little bit of animation and it's uh, our first steps into 3D with motion. Have some fun and play with it and see what else you can do. So this is Dave Allen for Video Magical and Max 20 Questions. Talk to you again soon.
Thanks for watching the video and why don't you check out the other videos. Here's two of them. There's one video there and one video there that you can click on and go and have a look at now. And don't forget that you can also subscribe. Talk to you again soon. Bye bye now.